Hello everybody. Today we assemble the oars, the mast and fit the sails. Let's start reducing the thickness of the ore from the middle toward the blade, then we work out the shaft. Now we work out the shaft, first f all we shape it to octagon, then we round it.
In the same way we round the mast. The base of the mast has a rectangular part, the point from which we have to start rounding is indicated by an engraving. I have already worked out the yard, we will come back to it later. Now we assemble the top mast bending strip. The mast is finished, I show you it closer. To assemble the loop with the thimbles, I pierced the mast. The stem of the rings is too long, so I cut it and glued with cyanoacrylate. The axle of the pulley is a 1.6mm brass rod and it presents a cap on one side. Before fixing the restraint belt on top of the mast, I worked out the ring with the hook for the yard lifting. I didn't shoot the assembly of many small details, so I show you just the final results.
The chain plate ring has been welded, while the same chain plate is fixed with two nails. As I said in the previous video, the ring lashing was not properly matching the mast, so I redid it with photo etched plate waste. It would be convenient to assemble and fix the lashing to the thwart before fixing the thwart to the model, when you have already done the mast. From the photo etched plate I cut a band with the same dimension of the original lashing. On both far ends the band is reduced in thickness to ease the bending, I reduced them with a mini drill. Now the lashing correctly embraces the mast. Let's come back to the yard and its rigging.
To lift the yard we need a cat one piece for moral support. I didn't shoot the work on all the rigging, so I show you the photos. The y'all assembly is finished. Thank you for seeing my videos, goodbye.